Hey, uh, I want to apologize for my lack of response, seeming lack of response. I feel like I'm, I'm not responding enough. Ever since the one of the videos that I made got featured, I've been... I don't really want to call it my videos. Not really my video that got featured. It wasn't me that got featured. It was a, a video that I made. A piece of art that I made got featured. Ever since, it kind of picked up. And the amount of people that have been contacting me has increased. And it's been harder to communicate with everyone. I, I, I have a lot of messages let you know if you send me a message and it comes up that it was unread. I actually read it. I go through and read all my messages and I just leave them yellow. I don't click on them unless I reply to it. And I, don't, I haven't been, I reply to some of them. It just depends. It depends on what's said, kind of, but like one thing, it could be like somebody could say one thing one day and I wouldn't answer it and then the same exact thing could be said another day and I'm in a different place in my mind and, and I answer it. It's like whatever, just, so if you, I don't answer a message that you sent to me, don't take it personally. Uh, and feel free to send me another message because I do read it and I really enjoy it. Oh, I really enjoy these messages. They're huge. <sighs> they're keeping me, they're guiding me. And the video responses, I haven't been able to keep up on these video responses. Like, I still have video responses. I want to watch these video responses from the video that got featured. Uh, there's like 250 of them or something. And then I watched a video response to uh, a video I just did. And that was... I watched a few. And then I realized, like, the video responses, a lot of them are people taking the same video that they'd made and just hopping it to my, new, my newest video. So I see a lot of the same video over and over, like the people are trying to get an exposure by tagging it on, rather than just making this response to me. Maybe it's that people want me to see it. Want to make sure I see it. You can always send it in a message, too. If you send it in a message and say, this is an attached video I made to you, watch it, or something like that, I'll be much more likely to watch it, because the... The video responses are like, and I'll have a lot of like unrelated video responses. I was thinking about approving them again, but I really like just having, letting anyone attach anything they want. Uh, even though it causes this chaos, you know, the, the, that I even bring it up to talk about it. I still like it. Max, I was talking to Max last night, and I said I was talking about actions on stick cam, and I was talking about stick cam, I hear is how it's pronounced, like sticky camera. Like you take it, move it around, and put it somewhere. Other people have called it stickum. It was spelled stickum, but I always thought it stick cam because it was a sticky camera. And it, now I've found from insiders working at stick cam that that is how it's pronounced. It's actually uh, Dominic's working over at stick cam now. Oh, by the way, I work at a restaurant called Dusty's in uh, Los Angeles. It's on Sunset. It's French Canadian. Come on by. Check it out. It's amazing food, and I'll wait on you, and I'll serve you. I will serve you. Let it be the ultimate, the ultimate retribution. You know, you must feel like I go on and on so much, and like you have to fucking sit there and listen to me. So come, make me wait on you. Make me get you lemonade and eggs. <laughs> and it'd be cool. It'd be great to meet people face to face and communicate and, and humanize it because the technology makes it seem like I'm like something. Like all these people in Hollywood, there's something. But it's every one of them is just people that you would meet and shake their hands and listen and talk to and, and communicate to. Nobody's any greater than that. It started with Hitler that people started thinking that people were greater than that and then kind of spiraled into this bizarre... So I was talking to Max bizarre to, into this bizarre what we have right now, and which is what I'm leading up to about Max. And I said, I was on stick cam and I was talking about uh, the next, like a Los Angeles gathering. Nicole, you were talking about driving down from Washington. I think it was, oh, you're up in 
Washington or Oregon. And uh, then I started thinking like, yeah, and I would love to have the San Francisco gathering. I guess it's just going to be whenever I get around, get my ass in gear to putting it on, the, the Los Angeles gathering. Because I want, I would love to have a YouTube Los Angeles gathering. I think it would be amazing. The weather's nice. Maybe it could be in a cold time of year across the rest of the country, world, Northern Hemisphere. Not that you guys in Australia are different, but I think the majority of the population resides in the Northern Hemisphere, so to coordinate would be more beneficial to the humanity in the long run in the majority. Man, people always seem to get left out when you make decisions. It's a hard part about being in charge. It's one of the hardest parts, I think, is that you got to cut people out when you let other people in. Is that really how life is built? Seems like it. Just got to be balanced with it and, and make sure everybody knows what you're doing isn't personal. That it's just, it's, you know, it's working out. We can work harder. So I told Max, I was like, whenever I get around putting that Los Angeles gathering on, I told Max, like, yeah, dude, I would put on that YouTube gathering in Los Angeles. There's one in New York and then one in San Francisco. And he said, don't do it. I said, why? He said, it's a bad idea, dude. Don't do it. And I started thinking, why would that be a bad idea? Because... Because of like the whole, I keep, I, I've seen, I don't even want to say it out loud. I won't. That's the way it works. I think it would be, I think his fear, why I should not do it, I'll say it, I'll confront it, is the, is the cult. The people, I, I keep seeing this fucking word. This word is what happened with fucking Brian Jonestown, Brian James, the Jamestown massacres. Jonestown massacres in the 70s, all these fucking idiots, these, these people that isolate, that take a group and physically isolate from society and live there, isolated from society. That is the problem. If these people would continue to be a part of society, these charismatic people, like the guy, who, the people, if they, rather than start a cult, fucking work at a day job or work in a restaurant or work with the homeless... And don't start fucking taking money from people just for being charismatic. Keep working. Be a part of society. And you can be as fucking charismatic as you want. It's not a cult. This is not a cult. This is a, a, a way of expressing myself. It's a, fucking, it's a fucking rock band, movie, uh, scientific theory. Okay, maybe, you know... I use that term lightly, but it's like all that stuff wrapped into one. This is my opus, my magnum opus. I am doing it now. I didn't wait till I was 40. I'm mean, going to just start doing it. This is like, it's not a cult. I'm not, I'm not, none of these people, like Christian, you came out here, dude, and it was so weird when I met you. It was, I was so, it was so awkward the way you were treating me, the way you were communicating to me. So I confronted you. And I think of you as a great friend of mine, per personally. You're here. I like being around you. I, I don't give you special treatment. You don't give me special treatment. We, we listen. It's, it's just a normal thing. But it's like the fantasy of all these people is, is, is creating this ridiculous concept like I'm in charge of something. And I'm not. I'm not controlling anything. Every single person, every single one of you people is controlling everything you're doing. What I, it's not about me. Take what I say and listen, if you want. Because that's what I'm doing, is listening to all the people around me. But don't just fucking cut it off at me. Listen to all the people around you. Realize that I'm just another slug in the dirt, wriggling around, trying to survive. Load. I'm going to watch that and take it in. And uh, hopefully I was able to get my point across. I know it got a little, it gets a little muddy sometimes, but that's what I've been feeling lately. <laughs>